bus, I come upstairs, and I go get snack. When our kids come here, they come in from a long day at school. And one of the things that we know about young people in general is their need to consume a healthy snack to give them the energy to continue to perform at high levels. So that if we want them to do their homework and do it well, if we want them to participate in a physical activity, they need the nourishment at three o'clock to sustain them through those afternoon hours before dinner so that they can continue to perform. Snack is important because we have to eat well and get a lot of energy. It gives you energy for the rest of the afternoon. Healthy snacks are an area that I'm passionate about to have sort of a foundation of what should I be putting in my body, what's going to fuel my body so that I can be energetic for my activities, so that I can help my brain uh, to the best of its ability to do the learning that needs to happen during the day. Unfortunately, we got a very disappointing email from the state letting us know that our funding for our after school snack program is cut. And our commitment to feeding the kids doesn't change but the funding issue has changed, and so we're now using a lot more operating dollars we're taking from other places in order to continue providing the kids with the afternoon snack they need. We decided to earmark our donation for this specific cause when we came here and saw that indeed the kids, part of the daily routine of the kids was having, having a snack, and it occurred to us that it was a really important educational lesson for children to learn that they should be putting the right kinds of foods in their body. My favorite snack here is crackers and apples. People should donate to the Boys and Girls Club because these kids are valuable. They're a valuable part of our community and I've seen the many ways that they contribute to the community at large.